Hey, my friends, uh, what's going on? Um, Happy New Year's uh, for everybody. Uh, December 31st today, the year is about to be over in a couple of hours. Uh, We have seen so many different devices, a release that came out and everything in 2013. You know, laptops, cell phones, tablets. Uh, I'm sure all of you cannot even wait to see what's uh, coming in 2014. Uh, But I want to finish the year by providing you guys uh, with this uh, benchmarking video uh, between these uh, uh, two computers. Uh, Because I I cannot stress enough how good this uh, small tablet uh, slash uh, laptop is. Uh, We're looking at the Asus uh, Transformer Book. Uh, This is a 10.1 inch uh, tablet slash uh, laptop. uh, Full Windows, uh, Windows 8.1. Now the RT, this is the full Windows version so you can install any programs or applications that you want. No limitations. Uh, As a quick recap. Uh, it comes with, uh, like I said, Windows 8.1, a 1.3 GHz quad-core processor, uh, 2 GB of RAM. Uh, we have a webcam, no rear camera. We have a 3.0 USB port here on this side as a part of the keyboard. And then as a part of the tablet, uh, right here, I'm sorry about that. Uh, right here on the side, we get a micro HDMI and another USB port with the 3.5 millimeter audio jack and then right there uh, we get access to micro SD card so you get all the ports that you need uh, on top of that uh, Microsoft Office uh, for a full year for free and then on top of that uh, you get the Asus uh, web storage I believe they advertise a uh, thousand gigabytes for free I believe at least for one year so a lot of really good things uh, going on with this uh, tablet uh, slash uh, laptop. Uh, of course, you know, we can detach it. That's what this is about. And uh, just uh, press right here. Uh, when uh, you detach it, you know, the, the tablet along it's uh, really small, very light. Uh, we get a like, glossy. Uh, kind of like a gray dark material on the back and then here's a look at the keyboard so what I want to show you guys is uh, right here next to next to the Asus uh, we have an Acer Aspire 1756 uh, this uh, laptop has an Intel um, processor uh, this is a dual core 1.40 as a matter of fact let's go ahead and access uh, control panel and show you guys uh, the information so you guys can see what I'm talking about I'm not making anything up all right so let's go ahead and access uh, control panel here too on the uh, Asus uh, right here okay so here's the Acer Aspire 1756 I hope you guys can see it it has a Windows score of uh, 4.7 which is actually pretty good for a budget uh, computer like this one uh, these days you can find this uh, a laptop for under $250 at Walmart and uh, when it came out it was about $300 it's still a pretty good laptop but the battery life sucks it's only like 3 or 4 hours huh? so anyways a uh, 4.7 Windows Core that's a pretty much the score of a lot of uh, uh, Core i3 machines and this is one of the few laptops that uh, will, t- will take up to 8 gig of RAM, which uh, that's what I have right now. I don't know if you guys can see it or not right there. 8.0, that's how many gig of RAM I have, DDR3, 64-bit operating system. So, uh, right here, looking at the, at the Asus, we have an Intel Atom, 
1.33 gigahertz quad core, uh, 2 gig of RAM, and 32 bit operating system. Uh, we're going to start the benchmarking test and show you guys the results. Alright, guys, so for this test, we're going to be using Nova Bench, which is a uh, free software. I'm going to go ahead and start here. And uh, we're going to compare the results. All right, guys, we got the score on uh, both computers. Um, so here's the Acer with uh, 340 points. And uh, I don't know if you guys can see or not, but this uh, software measures everything. It actually detects uh, what system we have. Uh, Microsoft Windows 7 Home Premium, Intel Celeron 1.40 Dual Core, uh, graphics, uh, graphic card Intel, HD graphics, uh, the memory, a gig, CPU test, graphic test, hardware test. So we get 340 points. Here's the, the Asus, and this is why I'm telling you guys, uh, don't pass the opportunity if you're looking for a small ta a laptop or tablet uh, with full windows and affordable. Look at the score, 354 points. And again, here's uh, all the details. Intel Atom, 1.33 GHz quad core, 2 GB of RAM, CPU test, uh, 3D uh, graphic test, hardware test. And uh, what I was telling you guys uh, right here, I got a notification uh, just uh, suggesting me to sign up for the Asus Web Storage. I don't know if you guys can read it or not. It says right there, we provide you with a thousand gigabyte free storage. So you get all these uh, free things or included things uh, with this uh, laptop uh, slash uh, tablet for $379, uh, the best of everything is the battery life. Uh, you're gonna get like 12 to 14 hours continued usage. Uh, if you don't wanna use this as a laptop, you can use it as a tablet. So guys, uh, that's all I had. Just wanted to prove to you guys uh, the performance and how good this uh, Asus Transformer Book is uh, T100. It's the model. Again, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Happy New Year. And we'll see you in 2014. See you later.